most recently, you heard about LSU winning the championship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard about it. How do you feel about the 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 controversy that's going on with Angela Reese doing the hand motion? Uh, you you know, you know, sports people uh think is they think is 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 it's not classy. They think it's very unclassy to to celebrate uh, touchdown dances. Uh, so so when we bring the hip hop culture uh, into the white sports world, uh, we have to expect that we're going to get some backlash. So let me just take you back. Uh, Dennis Rodman and Allen Iverson was the first NBA players to come in and have tat sleeves or tattoos, and they used to have to cover their tattoos up. Dennis Rodman started dyeing his hair. Uh, Allen Iverson started wearing braids. Uh, they changed the, the culture from 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 wearing uh, Daisy Duke shorts to to the to the long past your knees. You know, Magic Johnson and Michael Jordan them used to play basketball in panties. Uh, these niggas playing basketball in swim trunks, uh, baggy. So uh, this is just the first step in 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 you know female sports. Uh, accepting uh, women who, who who celebrate when they score when, when when they when they score right. So the young lady uh, Sh- Shakari Richardson, she she got a lot of flack, long nails, long hair, and when she running, she uh, that's 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 the culture of, of today's youth. And so the people who's being offended by it and making the comments are are are, are, are they the old folks? Do you feel like the M- WNBA should should pay their players more? No, hell no, nah. ain't nobody going to go see them bitches. Yeah, ain't nobody going to go see them bitches. Nigga, don't know, nigga want to see a bitch dunk. Them hoes ain't dunking. A couple uh, of them could dunk. I don't want to see a couple of them. I admit they got 12 motherfuckers on the team, seven of them motherfuckers got dunked that ball just like the man. They wanted equal rights. They got equal rights. Uh, Play a little bit harder. They, man, all, man, all them jump shots. Man, they don't want to see a bunch of jump shots. Men want to see a motherfucker back a motherfucker down. <laughs> Throw the jail. No, nah, we don't want to see them. No, nah, no, nah, we won't see them whole fight and all that kind of shit. So no, 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 no. They don't deserve no more motherfucking money. They really need to get a goddamn secretary job, get a basketball nigga, and then they'll get some more money. But just trying to stand over there on their own at the WNBA, they don't deserve shit. They ain't, they ain't been in hell. No, nah, they don't play that good of basketball or get that much money. So, 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 so you don't feel like. You could be a lawyer and a doctor and make more money than being a professional WNBA player. Yeah, basketball players dumb. Yeah, basketball players can't figure out nothing. Half of them broke after five years. So they're not the smartest people in the world. If they wasn't tall, just let me just say this. If basketball didn't exist, they'd just be a bunch of tall, dumb-looking people. They can't fit into society. So, okay, they take their dumb ass over there and go play basketball. When they get through playing basketball, what they do? Go talk in front of a camera, read some motherfucking teleprompters. They ain't good for nothing else. So, no, man, go be a lawyer. Don't be a basketball player. Be a housewife. Don't be a basketball playing woman. Yeah, no, that don't even make sense for a woman to try to go play basketball and then demand more money. No, glide from the free throw line. You know what them niggas had to do to get this money? Michael Jordan jumped from the goddamn free throw line. Dennis Robin used to get 20 offensive rebounds, 17 defensive in one game and not score a bucket. Men them hoes can't do that. Yeah, yeah, nah, I'm, a, I'm like the old day. They really need to be in the kitchen in the bedroom. Get their motherfucking ass off that basketball court. Let them boys play out there. 